Good morning, everyone. Happy Tuesday, almost like Monday, day after Labor Day, the, uh, I guess, unofficial start of fall. And uh, I stuck out another day in paradise to see this. Check this out. Check this out. Check this out. This is what happens when you wake up early in the morning and ride at dawn. <clears throat> we were out in the Hamptons, uh, stayed out one more night, went out to uh, dinner with mom last night and my godmother Aunt Marge and Uncle Frank and we went over to uh, Machut Beach and listened to the band and went over Roomba, grabbed some dinner, got to hang out with mom last night so it was kind of nice and uh, woke up this morning, another day in paradise before we get back to reality and uh, <clears throat> this is what we get to see out here, I love riding out here, not that we got a bad view back in there so, but it's gorgeous out here. So today's message of the day um, Listened to a little Joel this morning, and a uh, little Ryan Stuman this morning, and um, put that all together, and basically um, talk about um, God never gives up on us, so why do we give up on ourselves? Uh, a lot of us uh, negative self-talk ourselves. Um, <clears throat> if you say, I'm fat, um, you're, you know, even if you're kidding around, oh, I'm too fat to wear this bathing suit. You know, you're, you're self-doubting yourself. Um, you're talking down to yourself. You're holding yourself at a level that uh, you shouldn't be held at. If you um, say, oh, I'll never be uh, smart enough to do that, or I've had people, I'll never be as good as real estate as you are. Like, I tell people all the time, like, we're no different. We're no different. Just talk, to, talk positive to yourself. Don't talk down to yourself. Um, you know, I've heard people say, oh, I'm stupid, or I'll never get that, or... You know, you wouldn't talk to your friends the way you talk to yourself. You wouldn't talk to your kids the way you talk to yourself. So why do you talk to yourself like that? Why do you give up on yourself? Um, don't talk yourself down. Talk yourself up. You know, we talk about positive affirmations. Um, you know, talk yourself into it. Because uh, you can talk yourself out of, it, out of it just as quick as you can talk yourself into it. So talk yourself into it. Um, <clears throat> and then with that comes discipline. Um, Ryan talks about a discipline has a negative tone to it because growing up there was always talk about being disciplined as far as being punished. Um, you did something wrong, you got disciplined. Uh, the disciplinarian at schools. Um, but discipline um, is basically the result of a punishment because you are punished. Um, the discipline is what needs to take effect so that you don't get punished again. So it's not a negative thing, it's a positive thing, um, and we need to think of it like that. A lot of us don't want to commit to discipline, we don't want to commit to the gym, we don't want to commit to doing the work we need to do, we don't want to commit to getting up every morning and riding at dawn, um, because we have this negative uh, association with discipline, um, and it's just something to, to overcome. Um, again, God, uh, God never gives up on us, so we shouldn't give up on ourselves. Um, so just get out there and do it. Don't talk yourself out of it. Get some discipline in your life. You know, we, you know what you need to do, what's right and wrong. Um, <clears throat> you need to do it. You need to get disciplined, um, in a good way. We need to talk ourselves into it and we need to be positive with everything that comes into our life, everything that comes into our mind. So that's your message today. Hopefully that made sense to you. Um, we're going to look at the sun one more time here while we jump into prayers. Because this is absolutely beautiful. All right. In the name of Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, 
as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. All right. Dear God, we know you never give up on us, so please allow us to keep that in mind, no matter what happens, no matter what we do. We know you're there for us. Uh, please give us the confidence and the faith to stay disciplined in our lives and do what we know is right and do what we need to do to, to succeed. And please help us to keep a positive mindset that we may not talk down to ourselves and we may build ourselves up and build each other up. Uh, we are a brother's keeper, so we also have to build each other up. So, amen. Hi, right, everyone. So there's your message of the day. Happy Tuesday. Summer is not over, sort of unofficially, but not officially because it's beautiful out. So get out there and enjoy it. Make something of every day. Rise like the sun every day and shine. Put your head on a pillow every night knowing you did something to make the world a better place. God bless you all. We will see you soon. Tomorrow morning we're riding back in Malvern, 6 a.m. And uh, we hope to see you there. And I'll see you, of course, on here about 6.40. And uh, God bless you all. Have a great day.